I'm Sherry Shum, the IP creation lead for the radio power business. Many of you have been part of the historical development of NXP's power transistor product portfolio. Recently, we're able to celebrate the 25th anniversary of the first product qualification for the LDMOS transistor. A disruptive technology at the time, the LDMOS transistor rapidly became the gold standard in power transistors for cellular base station transmitters. You may know that the first patent for the LDMOS transistor was granted nearly 30 years ago to inventors right here in Arizona. Since that first LDMOS patent was granted to a portion of Motorola that's now NXP, our exceptionally talented team of RF power engineers have continued to patent the groundbreaking technologies associated with new LDMOS designs and fabrication methods. More recently, with the emergence of 5G cellular infrastructure and its higher power and operational frequency requirements, gallium nitride power transistors have begun to emerge as the new potential gold standard for cellular base station transmitters. The new GAN Fab in Chandler is a highly visible demonstration of NXP's commitment to this technology. However, that commitment is not new. For many years, NXP has been pursuing intellectual property protection for advanced scan transistor device structures and associated fabrication methods. With GAN transistors poised to take a front seat in cellular infrastructure deployments, NXP has accelerated its GAN development and along with it, our pursuit of innovations created in the context of this development. NXP's well-oiled invention submission and patent protection apparatus, coupled with well-trained technical and legal teams, enable us to continue to build a robust IP portfolio to protect new GAN-related inventions. NXP's IP in the GAN space covers inventions intended to optimize GAN device performance, reliability, cost, and size. More specifically, NXP's GAN IP portfolio protects inventions associated with GAN devices that have increasingly higher gain, efficiency, and power density, all the while exhibiting excellent linearity. With the proximity of the GAN fab to NXP's radio power group in Chandler, engineers may more rapidly develop, implement, and validate inventions for current and future generations of NXP GAN devices. This in turn yields shorter cycle times for developing and protecting our GAN-related innovations. For more information regarding NXP's IP protection processes, please contact the NXP legal team.